If you want to get in contact with me, the best way to do it is on Instagram. If you just want to say what up, if you want to tell me you love my videos, you can tell me that you hate my videos, but the best way to do that is on Instagram. Peace, y'all. Johnny Fastlane here. So, Young Thug and Gunner get arrested on RICO charges. Let's talk hip hop. Peace, y'all, it's your boy Johnny Fastlane here. So this situation is crazy, man, because Young Thug and Gunna um, just got arrested on RICO charges last night, right? Um, so the whole situation is this, man. Y'all know that Young Thug, he has this record label, it's called YSL, right? Young Stoner Life. But um, the FBI, they're saying that it stands for Young Slime Language or Young Slime Life or Young Slat Life or whatever the case may be. And, you know, slat or slime is like a blood terminology, right? And basically what they're saying is that Young Thug has been financing um, a Bloods gang in Atlanta for the last damn near 10 years. Allegedly, allegedly. Right, they even said that there was a schmurder back in 2015 that took place um, in a rental car, and the rental car was registered or rented under Young Thug's name. A whole bunch of craziness, right? Um, the whole situation is that prosecutors are even coming out saying that Young Thug and Gunna put a hit out allegedly, allegedly on YFN Lucci while he was in jail, right? And as you guys know, last month YFN Lucci was on the phone in jail um, when he got knocked upside the head, man. And so they're saying that that was from the Order of Young Thug, allegedly, right? Um, this is crazy as hell because no one saw this coming, but they have a lot of paperwork on them. They have been investigating them for a long time and they arrested 28 people to include Young Thug and Gunner, right? So whoever was down with YSL, whoever was around Young Thug, his security, his cameraman, his engineer, his artist, everybody is now arrested and sitting in jail right now, right? And it's not just regular jail, like they can't just post bail and get out. Um, they are in federal jail, so who knows if they're gonna get bail or not. And y'all know that the FBI has a 96% conviction rate, so this is not looking good at all, right? Uh, currently, there are 56 counts or 56 charges. Uh, most of Young Thug's charges are circumstantial, which is good. Um, that just basically means that they're seeing him say YSL uh, in his music video or say YSL or uh, a Young Slat Life or whatever like that in a song or something like that, and they're trying to say that is a call to his gang, right? Um, it's easy for him to say, nah, this is just rap stuff if he has a good lawyer. I mean, I guess we will see, right? Within the first 24 hours when the feds arrest you, they sit you down and they say, listen, man, we will give you 60 years in prison if you don't tell us everything, right? That's what they did to 6 9 They basically was like, come on, yo, you're a rapper. You ain't really from the streets. You don't really want to go to prison for the rest of your life, do you? I um, mean, right there, that's when that person makes that decision, right? So who knows what's going to happen with Young Thug? Who knows what's going to happen with Gunna or the other 26 people that they arrested because anybody could tell. Um, so this this is not looking good. That's all I'm going to say. But um, I'll let y'all know more later on. And um, let me know what y'all think about this in the comments.